Hup. Psst. Hup. Today we're going to learn a basic bojitsu or combat bow, realistic bow combination. We're going to take a look at what it looks like with our partner and you can practice it with someone or alone either way. What we're doing here is our partner or our attacker of course is throwing a front thrust at us. Now as the front thrust comes we're doing what is called a push block or an outside push block. We're taking the staff and we're pushing it to the outside of our body because of course the thrust is coming directly online most likely to our chest, our solar plexus, somewhere like this. We're pushing it offline. After pushing it offline natural motion we can take our back arm over the top, over the head and swing down, smash down to your opponent's shoulder, their clavicle, even to their head if you need to, or to their neck, depending on the angle that you're at. Let's take a look at this from this angle. So what's happening is I'm starting in my basic fighting stance. Legs are apart. This is a middle guard position. That, what that means is the staff is about in the middle of my body. From here I'm prepared for lots of different ranges of attacks. As I see the, the forward attack coming, I push it offline by taking my backhand and bringing it across my body and I swing it across rotating my hips and I thrust the staff forward. From here I swing in a circular motion around over the top smash down with the staff turning my hand over. This is an overhead front strike from Ultimate Bow if you have learned this. We're turning our hand over striking down and then from here we could move on to the outside to the knee down thrust, lots of other things going to the outside open section of the body since the weapon is over here. So now we have our padded, our sparring bows. We're going to demonstrate that same combination a little bit faster for you so you can see what it looks like with a different staff. Hup. Psst. Hup. Very nice. So while you're practicing this, if you're alone, just imagine you have an attack coming directly on the center line. It's important that you get over across fast with your arm in your rotation. And whenever, if you are practicing with a partner, if you're the partner, make sure when you're throwing that thrust, you're not already thrusting it to the outside. That's not going to make your partner work. That's cheating. Make sure it's coming in. If you miss it, if you have a padded staff, go ahead thrust. You're going to be fine. Okay, it's a padded staff. Um, but of course it makes you actually get it out of the way, strike, you have a little bit more intensity, a little bit more realism while you're practicing. Hope you enjoy that combination, practice that, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.